update on the tracks of slash uh first of all i've been having so much fun with the rustler and ha i'm actually happy that i actually got it uh but once uh but like during the time when i had my rustler um just driving it and my slash has been sitting in the bench for quite some time the motor is still fine uh, but my servo wasn't I stripped a lot of gears on my original servo. It was a hobby people motor, a servo. But since hot my local hobby shop here in San Francisco, um, my nearest one is like Concord, and it's Hobby Town USA, and they don't have they don't have the things for hobby people because it's obviously a proprietary design. So, luckily, I went to my local electronic store, Radio Shack. And I've actually bought myself a Radio Shack servo. Um, I was having a lot of trouble, so I had to disassemble it, and then I got it fixed and re reassemble it again. And once I did have that working, it works perfect. Um, yeah, it does work very fine. Uh, at first, I was steering well. Hold on. Another fail, really? Fail, but it was not. Um, I just had to disconnect it. Uh, disconnect the thing. Let me show you why. Because every time I connect the battery, like okay, my, first of all, my controller is still on. Every time I connect it, it does this a lot. Just watch. Just you gotta see this. Got to try to connect that. It's kind of hard to do this with one hand. And it usually does that, but once I, if I take this, take the servo link, servo connector out, out of the receiver, and then I put it back in, it works fine. The only thing that I need to fix on here is this, is the king pin on this right, on the right here, on this side. Because it's severely bent, but I was able to shove it back in there, but I need just need to get a new one just in case. And plus this caster block here is starting to crack a little bit, but it's not too bad. But I need just need to get the new parts for it just to make sure to be on the safe side. But aside on from that, it works great. My, um, first of all, that the servo saver, I don't know if you can see that. The servo saver, it used to be a four-way, but I had to cut it down because the servo was too short. So yeah, there we go. There you guys have it. A new working servo, and I still need to get my new brushless system. But for now, if the car can still run, it it will run. So there you guys have it. I'm gonna go put the tires back on and see you from there.